to the video. I'm on the Syndicate 48 hours. I'm on a birthday social. It's the Hilbury Tembis 40th birthday on Thursday. I have to shoot Wednesday. Can't get Thursday off work. What that's about. To be honest, I was lucky to get Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday off. <laughs> yeah, so I'm buzzing. Yeah, um, seeing fish in front of me. I'm in peg 5B, pretty much in the middle of... Pretty much... Oh, see that? <laughs> fish in front of me, definitely. I hope the camera got that, that show then. That's the range I'm fishing. So between 14 and 15. No, 15, 14 and 17 wraps ish, whatever, how many yards that is. Uh, three solid bags, rods are on the floor. Um, I saw the fish show. I wanted to get the rods out as soon as I've set my alarms up to the right in the right, on the grass because I've not got a pod with me. And it's quite firm this peg, it's all stoned out and that so yeah. I didn't want to move the line across. Do you know what I mean? I don't want to move them, so I've, got, I've, got, I've cast three solid bags of three showing fish basically. They're in front of me and next door to me, but no one's in next door to me, so I can be cheeky and fish in their water with a rod or three. Depends where the fish end up. <laughs> yeah, but I've got, uh, I've got a load of bait. Kurt's here. Wish he wasn't, but he is. Um, <laughs> I was hoping he'd set off from his house and never make it somehow, but he's turned up, so he'll have to do. Yeah, I'll let you know how we get on. Um, confident, definitely confident seeing the fish show. Although I think from what I've seen on the Facebook page, bloody hell, the past few weeks I've seen one picture of a fish. I don't know how much it's been getting fished. I don't know what's come out. I know at least one has, but it's not been uh, on fire, the old syndicate group with pictures of fish in that. So, But it's better than being in work. You've got to be in it to win it. And even if it's not going to fish throughout whatever, a week, two weeks, whatever it is, three weeks, Someone's got to be the first to catch, aren't they, again? So, could be me. Hopefully it will be. Hopefully all three of us have some. But they are moving. There's fish in front of me. And, uh, yeah, I've got a couple of decent tips, actually, this video. Got a belter about going to the toilet. Quality tip, this. I, I, I've paid a hefty price for not following this this tip. So, yeah, so, uh, yeah a couple of tips coming up in the old video. <laughs> yeah. All right, and uh, I'll let you know how we get on. I'll see you shortly. All right. We've seen the ugly nude we once today. Oh, curva! <laughs> oh, curva! <laughs> Message for me uh, Polish friends at work. The hillbilly Polish! <laughs> Put the kettle on, Kurt. I am actually. You're saying that just for the camera? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's fucking weird this, though, isn't it? You could go cast six inches to the right or left. Fishing over a bin lid at 400 yards. Kurt. Oh, so much short then. Right yeah. in line with them swans. Hey, Kurt. Unless it was a cormorant. I mean, I mean, the tree's on my own at the back of the swip. It's like an old port, a cabby portal away somewhere. I've seen a boat called Bob. And he said there's, there's a bit of petrol in a mower in there. I could use it for the fire. But, look where I am. Bad news this, this is bad news. I'm just on my own in the bleeding forest. What is going on? Uh-oh. This is like some of uh, Blair Witch shit, this. Yeah, sat this. I'll find me off. I'll find something else to start the fire. What oh, that? Good morning. Oh. Nippy this morning. It's made the older, uh, the brew. Oh, too much sugar in that, the hell. That with diabetes drinking that. <laughs> diabetes. But the hell. Not a beep. Not a beep. Well the wind, but not a not a liner. Not a liner last night. <clears throat> Just seen Kurt on his way to the toilet. Nothing for him. Or the overly timber. Absolutely nothing. The camera up a little bit. Oh, that's better. Well, I'll say it's better, you don't want to see my face for too long, do they? <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I didn't do anything to the camera yesterday, again, like after the sort of the intro. Uh, we <coughs> we'll have you more of the social, I don't get to fish with the Ubley tent, well, James, a lot. Me and Kurt fish together, uh, not regular, but you know, a good few sessions Kurt's involved in it, so. And uh, James, oh, don't, don't get out as much as he'd like to unfortunately obviously he's got a mad busy life and everything so yeah the takeaway Kurt, Kurt started a fire arsonist 
Yeah, not what it was. As soon as he went for the takeaway, Kurt said, okay, finally went out. <laughs> Me and James couldn't do it. So this Kurt comes back. It's like, should I be steam tuned, Kurt? As soon as you see him, should have that, uh, that song from Prodigy, that Firestarter. Just as he's walking about, that should be his theme tune. Yeah, it's pretty, yeah, well, I've just seen him, he's gone to the toilet. But his face, he looked like he was buzzing and have you had anything? And no, not a, nothing, not a, not a beep. So I, it just looked like he was going to tell me something. Yeah, but uh, anyway, here's my first tip. Very, very good tip this. Don't hold a poo in for 48 hours. I paid the price at Baden Hall. Baden Hall, uh, didn't know where the toilet was, didn't want to reel in. Loads of people about, never been there before. But I'm not leaving my stuff here unguarded. About an hour after I got there, I started needing a number two. Obviously, for a, for a wee, go anywhere you want, can't you? As long as you're not like exposing yourself to kids and passers-by and stuff. But number two, I thought, I'll hold it, it'll be all right. Managed to fend it off till uh, the second night. I was in my sleeping bag and I thought, oh no. I thought, I just have, just have, to, just have to struggle. <laughs> Woke up. On the morning, the morning I had to go home, and, uh, apart from my sleeping bag smelling like the inside of a bag of peanuts. Yeah, I thought, oh, yeah, I've got away with that. But as I was packing up, I thought, I'm, I'm not going to make the journey. I, I, I the journey home, I need to find the toilet. So on my way, on my way out, I tried to find my way out of the bloody gaff. I seen two portaloos. I thought, sweet, right. Rolled up, bin, rubbish in the bin. First portaloo walked in. Looked like it had lost a fight with a tub of chocolate ice cream. <laughs> but it weren't ice cream, if you know what I mean. So I thought, oh, I'd rather soil myself than use that. So one next to it, immaculate. Yes, buzzing. And uh, that's when the ordeal began. Obviously, because I'd held it in, I had quite a bit of food, it just accumulated. So as I'm, as I'm getting rid of it, it's getting bigger and bigger. And uh, thinking, Jesus, it was that big. <laughs> Nearly zero on my sling. Well, it's got to be an upper double, that. Anyway, got rid of it. Oh, thank God for that. Sat there for about 30 seconds after. Half, half thinking a placenta is going to follow it out. And I got back in the car and I thought, you know what, women moan about childbirth. Yeah, love, you've not held a shit in at Baden all for 48 hours. Come back when you have childbirth. Tell you what, that was nothing compared to my ordeal. Yeah, so that's me. Uh, that, that's a good tip for everyone. Don't hold it in for 48 hours. Just reel in and go to the toilet. I'll pay a hefty toll, like I did. See how Kurt knocks up one of his award-winning solid bags. <laughs> right, first Kurt. What, what's in the bottle? What's in the uh, bucket? There's all sorts. Um, just micro pellet in different flavours, really. Yeah, anything from two mil up to. I think them green ones there are three mil. I think, but yeah, nothing special, no liquid, well, I've got liquids, but I've not put anything on them. Standard, as Dave would say. <laughs> right, show us your rig quick, Kurt. The rig? Yeah. yeah. The rig that's going in. Ah, there we go. Right. So we've got... Well, starting off, you've got Gemini, carp stem, solid bag stem even. Uh, two ounce lead. Four inches of armor link, uh, orange corn, size five fang X, and then just a tiny bit of shrink tube to open up the gap. So yeah, dead simple really. I'd have a 12 mil wafter on there, size four hook, uh, decent bit of shrink tube. I think an angler's hook that. Kurt's done really well on him uh, so far. I looked at him, they're mega sharp out of the packet. Supple braid, uh, got be, it's got to be four inches maybe, five. Two ounce lead solid bag stem. That's basically it. And uh, if I show you the other rig, which is on now, the other leg, <laughs> here's what I had over the spot. Didn't want to put all my eggs in one basket. So I've got a Royal Marine pop up bait works. Uh, I've got a bait screw. I think that's a thinking angler's one that. It's got a ring swivel with a plastic screw. And it is, it's, well, I suppose it's a multi rig really. I've seen uh, pictures uses it, but I was watching Adam Penning on Carpology. I'm, I'm sure it was Carpology. And uh, the rigs, I always fancied this one, I forgot about it. But, uh, yeah, it's just a multi-rig. Underneath that putter, that's £30 rigidity, 
the focus is slag. Uh, all bright now under that. Better put around it. Oh, bloody hell. <laughs> Fox tongue skin. Quite long, because obviously it's uh, getting, a, getting a, a drop, but it's not like a fur. It's, it's still quite soft the bottom. Because any bits of silt weed and stuff like that. And it's, yeah, that's me two, uh, that's me two rigs. I'm on all three of them at the minute. Sold such wood. There's my rods. Tripod. There's the old net. The old net over there. That's going to be sodden by the time we finish. That is going to be sodden. Right, so we've had. I suppose it was nearly a double take, wasn't it? Yeah. Nine fish out in eight weeks. Somehow we've had two between us. Hey, it's bigger than a fort mine. It's actually all right, that. Hopefully it's as big as yours. It's very similar, don't they? It's nice like worms, it's really nice. Lively now. Right, do you want to just, oh, I was going to say, get my carp care out the finger. Like a bit of a lifting scale or something. About 40, 13, 40, about 40, mine I reckon. Well, do you reckon it'll alright? Yeah. I'll try and get some Yeah. Big G's doing my photo, Kurt's doing James's. Unlucky James. <laughs> James's first fish from the Syndicate. Yeah, was it? Kurt, watch that camera behind you, mate. Yeah. The picture, that's yeah, fine. yeah. Lift it up, I did. I said, that was that? okay, that's better. Yeah. Fingers are you right smile, there. you twat. Let's move off. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Boom. Yeah, there we go. No, Dorsal okay. up, very angry. Do it, Dave. Look <laughs> okay, G, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Sorted. That'll do, buzzing. Oh, nice one. Okay, Cheers, well. lads. It's the hillbilly Tembi's 40th birthday social this. Um, his missus sent him. Mad. I didn't know you could get these. It's Neil Ruddock, uh, Razor Ruddock, giving him a birthday message on a video, just swearing at him and abusing him. So I'll put it in now, uh, explicit language to follow. La 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 la, aye 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 aye, big Jim, oh, it's on, you big fat ginger bastard, yeah. How you doing, son? This is a happy birthday. Happy 40th birthday, son, from Razor Ruddock and Stacey. Now, Stacey and the kids. They love you and appreciate everything you do for them, even though you're a twat, all right? Stacey and the kids love you loads, even though you are a big ginger twat. Anyway, Big Jim, have a fucking lovely birthday, my old mate. From Razor Mark, Stacey and the kids, twat! Right, sir. Fish number two. Off the same spot. Over the bait. Oh, well, I've shown the bait actually. I'll show it on the old video. Pretty decent this one. Not weighed it, but it's uh, bigger than the other one. Kurt kindly gave me a solid bag. Last time I did it, I haven't read it. So he gave me one to put back on the spot after the last fish. It's quite decent, that, you know, Kurt. Lovely that. Yeah. Yeah, nice common, number two. My solid bag, my fish. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Kurt's had to have a mirror. Um, about, about £12, you say ish. Yeah. So I'll get the pictures of that in as well, but we've all caught now. That's four fish between three of us. And there's been eight, no, been nine out in the last eight weeks, so looks like they're switching back on. Was it? Right, so let's get some proper pictures. Uh, we'll slip her back. Or him. That might be transgender. <laughs> Right, bounce it, then you can get an accurate. A bit more still. 29. 29 and a quarter. Yeah. 
what? 29.4. 29.4. Yeah. yeah. Okay, now we're... What's going on? I'm at first, we're not... We're safe. 29.4 Right Kurt, 29.4 He's done it again <laughs> He's done it again That is just, that's a unit that Kurt I said there was a PB in the session for me But it is isn't it, it is not me. even a PB for Kirk I know, 29.4 and it's not okay, your PB now. Jesus, that is just the... It's the biggest fish you've seen on the bank. Yeah, 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 it is, yeah. Fuck <laughs> you now. Right, you really don't. Yeah, it's recording, mate, yeah. Fucking, yeah. we well undergunned it as well, didn't we? I was like, then, 23, 24. It's the width, that's the white, yeah. it's the width, isn't it? I knew it was a sweaty looking at it, and in fact, lifting it up, that's definitely a sweaty in the net. So recording, Dave, yeah? Yeah, I was like, I can edit it, I just left it on. That is a fucking beast. Look at that. <laughs> that is going to be the one of the wise. It's 29.4. That is me. <laughs> Jack! 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 Well, do you reckon, Kurt? Are you happy with that? Yeah, a little bit. Papa Booby Diop. What, what, what's that? <laughs> what's that? It's beneath you because you've had a fur. <laughs> you just wanted to slip it back without a pick. Right. What size of that? Keep back. <laughs> Massive that. Like Morning. Well, that was a that was a turnaround last night, wasn't it? Gone from oh, there was that message in the um, yeah, we've gone from nothing, casting bags at showing fish, you know, move, so not moving swims, but sitting out and another swim for a, you know, for a few hours. Tried everything, been through a movie round. Uh, last night, yeah, sat around the fire, heard this vibrating. I mean, you, you would have seen all the footage now of the fish and everything. Um, so, obviously, five, I think I was talking to a bloke called Bob and he said, since Kurt had the scar coming a couple of months ago, I think he said eight weeks, there's been nine fish out. Oh no. <laughs> Story of my fishing, that, innit? Everywhere I go. <laughs> but that's fishing, it's fishing fish, it's fish and stuff everywhere, innit, at the minute, I believe. So, what was the line of then? Uh, what was I saying? Yeah, so last night, obviously, we've had five between us, uh, three of us. James and Kurt have got another night to go. I'm making some porridge, we'll start packing my stuff down soon. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, absolutely buzzing. Every fish caught on solid bags. Kurt, my, my second fish, actually, I didn't have a solid bag ready after the first fish. Kurt had one ready made, he actually gave it me. Said, get that on and get the rod back out. And I caught my second fish on his. Um, even though his is the lesser bag. <laughs> no, I'm making a porridge now. Making a porridge. Kettle's, well, will be boiling. Uh, all I've done, the spot I had both fish off, I've left two solid bags on it. I'm, I'm not going to touch them. Um, if I was doing another night like the other two, I would have reeled them in, I think, and re put fresh bags out. All I've done, I put four, no, was it three? Three or four spawns, medium spawns of the, the bait mix um, I was using, which was same as bathing all, really. Uh, maggots, I think they're all dead now. Maggots, some of that frozen krill, um, casters, and boily crumb. Uh, what I did from bait and all, the bait I didn't use, I just got a bucket, I've got a chest freezer in my fishing cupboard, just put it in the freezer, the old, the old thing. Uh, Kurt, give me some more dead maggots and casters. Oh, that's just come right out, that. <laughs> um, my left hand rod, it was at 19 wraps, just in front of this, I might have just, just over the back of this band of weed and nothing, not even a touch. So what I've done, keep seeing fish in the day, showing tight to the farm, Argy. Um, so got a solid bag, <clears throat> or got a three ounce lead first, clipped up tight, uh, just in front of this bush, and as the lead hit the water, a fish come out about a couple of feet from the lead, um, and I've seen a fish show just to the left of it, and about a rod length to the right of it now, um, got an extra small solid bag, two ounce lead, um, stepped into the cast, I wanted to hit it first time, it's about 
23 wraps maybe but I, I get it but I didn't want to I wanted to get it first time you know minimum disturbance so na nailed it luckily for me so and they're still fishing that far margin so um, yeah I've got a rod there that's the only thing I've done for today because I've got about three hours three or four hours I have to do one. Oh, kettle's boiling yeah that's right you boil your slack you boil oh porridge got these from farm foods definitely the inferior breakfast definitely claims it's golden syrup flavor I claim it's nothing flavor but that's not that bad can't really taste much it's just, it's just porridge in it of uh, just oats yeah it's better than nothing better than no food put my tackle safe on top of it to keep the steam in yeah that's uh that's that's the morning's update so yeah personally i've had two fish but mid I mean, first about 14 maybe second was about 17 i reckon um obviously i'll stick the pictures in and that kurt's beast 29.4 he's just he's just at it again he's just done it again hasn't he? <laughs> picked off um, one of the big you know it wasn't like the other there's been some a couple of 30 30 pound commons come out dead dark on the top this one it was dead light all over. It was like one of the commons that me and James caught. So I can, you know, I could sort of generic mid double one, just sort of light yellowy gold, but it was massive. So um, <clears throat> I've not seen that fish on the pictures on the Facebook group or anything. So that'll be 30 soon, probably. Right, I'm going to eat my porridge. Hope that far margin rod goes and I can eke one more out um, before we go. Right, I'll speak to you shortly. I've had done me 48 hours. <laughs> It'll be nude week, 40 tomorrow. Oh, Kurt hell. won't make it to 40 because the police are onto him. He's not even at 30, are you, Kurt? No. Ple yeah. The police are on the Welsh border waiting for him. <laughs> <laughs> right, thanks for watching. Make sure you watch till the end. Well, you'll see this at the end anyway, won't you? Don't turn it off yet, got some good pictures. We've got another night. Yeah, got another night, these two. <coughs> Five fish between us. Um, there's more in it. Right, Cap and I go out. Adios. Oh. Adios! <laughs> <laughs>